Good morning, everybody. This is T, and I'm back with another video. How's everybody doing? Good morning. Praying all is well. Here, I'm eating my Yo Play yogurt. <laughs> oh, it's not focusing. The strawberry banana, that's the only one I like. Butter's down there on the floor <laughs> watching me eat it. I um just wanted to come on and let everyone know once I reach 300 subscribers, I'm going to do a giveaway. A um, couple of the, the things you need to do is be subscribed to my Instagram, which is Terry's Journey. And you're also going to need a cash app. Um, and another thing, I, people have been asking me for a house tour. I did do one early on. Um, so I'll do one tomorrow. Um, what else was it? Someone asked about, um, oh, about my, my, how I became disabled. <laughs> if you go back in my early vlogs, wow, that had to be like a month or almost two months ago, I... I put that out. You can go back and look at that. If you like, it'll tell you what happened. But I can give you a little bit of insight on what happened. But if you want to know the whole story, you'll have to go back, look at my vlogs and find it. And it'll tell you, you know, step by step what happened. But I was assaulted by a guy years ago. And, um... It was a boyfriend I had known for for some years, so I don't invite anybody into my home or anything unless I've known them for almost a year. A lot of men I dated didn't understand that, but I don't let anybody in my house or around my kids, So, and my kids were babies then. So what happened, he assaulted me, period. His, he he hurt one of my babies, and when I found out he did he did that, I confronted him. He hit me with the bat, a bat, um, right between my eyes here. I don't know if you can see the scar, and it left me blind in this eye and blurred vision in the other. Um. I also have severe asthma. Well, it's not severe, but I also have asthma. Um, what else? I also have sciatica. I, I'm, I know a lot of people know what sciatica is. It's, it's no joke. Um, I also have bad knees and hips from doing so much uh walking up hills to exercise that I mess my hips and knees up so I don't do heels anymore so but I do still walk so I have to have a mobility scooter that's supposed to be coming soon because I can't walk long distances and I can't stand for long so if you want to know any more about it you know in detail somewhat you can go back in my video, I think it's like some months ago, and, and look at that vlog. It'll tell you. But I am still on my weight loss journey. I don't know what my weight is right now. I don't weigh myself all the time. It'll discourage you to weigh yourself all the time. So it's better probably to weigh yourself every two weeks or once a month. Because you're, sometimes your weight flux, flux your weights. It goes up and down, so you can say, "Oh, I, I'm only I lost a pound," then you gain a pound or two back. So you have to at least weigh yourself every two weeks. So every month, what's been working for me a lot is I walk for fifteen to twenty minutes a day. Um, sometimes it may be a little longer if I don't realize it. A half an hour, I try. I have to take breaks in between, of course. I, I can't stand or walk long. So when you see me on my vlogs, I haven't been walking for a long time. I have to stop and go. So, I, but I still have to do it. 
I've cut back back my calories. And it's not really what you eat, it's how much you eat. So you can eat anything you want, bread, anything. It's just that you have to eat it in moderation. Like if you ate two pieces of bread for breakfast, two for lunch, and two for dinner, you're only supposed to have two pieces of bread a day. So you'd have to decide, do you want it for breakfast do you want it for lunch or do you want it for your bread for dinner or you can just cut out bread there's dietary breads as well so i've been putting everything in the air fryer um what else have i been doing i kind of cut out sugar well i really haven't had sugar for months almost a year so i've been cutting out sugar i've been drinking my coffee black i got used to it um, I've cut out a lot of pastas, whites, well, whites is pasta, bread, sugar, you know, anything white. But like I said, you can eat what you want. It's how much you eat is the problem. I also drink my green tea before bed. It's supposed to be known to eat up fat. Don't quote me on that, but. Green tea is good for that, burning energy and stuff like that. So I drink the green tea before I go to bed. I also drink uh, apple cider vinegar with mothers. Uh, I put green tea with it, ginger. I also put garlic. And sometimes I put a little cayenne pepper. And I drink that every day, every single day. Because my doctor even said, you don't have diabetes or anything? And I said, no, I don't have it. By the grace of God, why would you even say that? I, I've always, I even told my husband when I came out of the office, she was shocked that I didn't have it. I guess it's because you're with my weight or whatever. But people have to realize, people that are heavier or whatever, heavier or whatever aren't always the one that's not in good health. It could be a skinny person that's in good health or, you know, that's not in good health, so... And I told her, I think it's because of the, the drink that I've been drinking for years every day, the apple cider vinegar with the mixture that I just told you about. I think that's what keeps my sugar down and stuff like that. So the apple cider vinegar is really good. I wouldn't drink it straight. It burns your esophagus. <laughs> it's so strong. I tried it when I first started. I was like, oh my God, I'm never going to do that again. So looking at myself on my phone, I do look like I'm coming down. I know I'm coming down. I'm not going to say I look like I know I'm coming down. I'll get there. It's not going to happen overnight. That's something you have to know. It's not going to happen overnight. Um... You didn't gain it overnight, <laughs> so you definitely aren't going to lose it overnight. Um, I still have the other vlog coming up. I, like I said, I'm going to do the house tour. I'm going to do me and my hubby, how well we know each other. <laughs> we're going to be going on vacation next month. Well, my daughter's getting married next month, so we're going to be doing that. Um, so I'll be vlogging that, uh, her wedding and... Things leading up to that, the hotel, and she's getting married on the beach, so I'll be vlogging um, us, us on the beach. Um, me picking at my bonnet is always, is, there's a debate going around now about bonnets, what it makes people look like this and that. The other one lady said that it made people look ghetto. And that kind of bothered me, that kind of hurt me, because what does looking ghetto look like? So that, when she, when she wrote that comment, I said, hmm, coming from an African-American as well, that kind of bothered me, but mm -mm. people stay judging. I thought only God could do that, but people stay taking, taking over God's job. 
Um, I'm putting uh, my hair update. I'm putting uh, coconut oil, a lot of different oils in my hair. I usually use that all the time. I mix it with the I mix it with um, a little bit of Vaseline, as I used to do in the old days. If who, I'm sure some of you older women and men know what I'm talking about, <clears throat> and I rub it in my hair. <laughs> Excuse me. Sometimes, maybe twice a week or so. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get my teeth done. I'm gonna be. Um, my father took my bottle, my pacifier away, my bottle away from me too early. My mother was, she told me he took my bottle away too early and it made me start sucking my thumb. But, um, I don't suck my thumb anymore. I haven't sucked my thumb in years. <laughs> so I'm getting all my teeth removed. They're, they're, they're bothersome. They're irritating. I, I hate them. <laughs> It's almost as if I hadn't sucked my thumb or anything. I probably would have still gotten them taken out because I'm. It's it's just irritating me now at this point. Um, sometimes I get a cavity. Or I have to have teeth pulled. The toothache is so irritating. So I want them all all what is extracted. I want them all taken out. I don't know if I'm gonna get false teeth or. Uh, the screws in. I don't know. Yeah, so I'm gonna have get. I'm gonna get that done. I have to get my glasses. These aren't my. These are new glasses, but these aren't the glasses I'm supposed to be wearing. I'll have to go pick up my prescription. Well, my hubby should be picking it up. Before he comes home from work, um, not my glasses, just the prescription, so I can go get those. Um, I think that's the most of the update. I, I told you I'm waiting on my mobility scooter to come. I'll re I'll sh try to record that because they want me to get on it and they want to make sure I know how to work the levers and stuff like that. Um, yeah, and that's basically it. As I said, I'll put out that house tour tomorrow. Well, this is a townhouse, so it's still a house, but I'll put that out tomorrow. Um, I'm going to be doing some things to my front yard, um, decorating that for, excuse me, for spring. So I'm going to be doing that. Mm. That's basically it. I think I basically filled you guys in on a lot of things. I just want to say that I appreciate all my subscribers and those in the bushes or in the background that are watching. And It's okay. You can subscribe. I love you too. Even the ones that want to come on here and pick at me or whatever. I still love you too. I pray for you. Things will get better. We can be friends. It's okay. Um, I think all my new subs that I've gotten along the way. I appreciate you so, so much for subbing as well as my OGs. And I pray that you all stick with me through this journey so that you can see all the new things that are about to come for me. <laughs> um, I, 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 want, I want you all to just see the outcome of everything I'm, I'm getting done to myself as well as my home and everything so i'm praying that it all prospers you know my page everything prospers for us all and that a lot of people stop uh some people i've noticed have come on my page and taken advantage of kind of the way i feel sometimes or whatever and they they'll say they'll write a nice comment to sub to me and then once I sub to them, they'll take theirs. They'll take theirs back, you know, as if uh, it's a trick and them getting an extra sub. Please don't do that. Please, I appreciate it. Um, it's not that. It's not that serious. Um, that's not the way to to get subs. Um, 
about using someone like that um because what goes around comes around so be careful um so I, I, I just want to say I love all my subscribers. I appreciate you so, so, so much. And, and this comes from the heart. Um, I, I watch all you guys' vlogs. I, I comment on all you guys' vlogs. I thumbs up every vlog. Um, that, that support right there. That support. Um, I notice a lot of people don't hit the thumbs up button when they watch my vlogs. Please try to hit... Uh, Give me a thumbs up um, as well. I know you all love to comment, and I appreciate them so much, but I need those thumbs up. <laughs> um, if you see some of my vlogs, you think you, you could share that would help someone, I would appreciate that. So, like I said, I love you all. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you already haven't. Hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and hit that notification bell so you'll, get, so you'll know every time a vlog pops up. Um, again, I appreciate you. Thank you all. And, um, there was something else that I needed to talk about, but I really, I really don't remember. Um, yeah, I don't remember right now, but that happens sometimes. Um, I want to sit up a little more, but I don't have my bra on. You know how it is early in the morning. You get up. I have a little patch here because I had a, I get a little pain from me doing my arm twirl. So, yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, I put an icy hot patch right there sometimes. And they do work. They work for me. So, and well, that's it. I'm going to eat my, yo finish eating my yogurt. And I, I ordered this. Isn't it too cute? It's, it's a spilling coffee. It's coffee. It's the illusion of coffee spilling. And I love it. I have a brown one as well. I think it's really cute. <laughs> um, yeah, that's it, guys. I'm going to let you go. I'm not going to keep and babble on and babble on. But, yeah, be looking out for those vlogs that will be coming out and i appreciate you all so much have a blessed day bye bye